Right now, technical schools and community colleges are working to train new welders to meet the increasing workforce demand. In this week's Skill to Work, I spoke with a young man who not only wanted to be a welder for years, but right now is considered to be the best student welder in the country. Jacob Humphrey works with several different types of metals. The Wallace State Community College students started welding when he was 14. My grandpa had an old Lincoln buzz box welder and also known as a tombstone welder. So I'd go home after school and practice on some scrap metal in the shop and then he'd help me fix some things around the farm. On Friday, he added a new piece of metal to his arsenal, a gold medal from the Skills USA competition. You get down to those final three and you don't hear your name on third and you don't hear your name on second. You really get nervous when you hear first and <laughs> it was my name, so I felt relieved after that. About 6,500 students competed across more than 100 different skills contests this past weekend. Humphrey's medal is the second gold for this welding program and its first since 2009. While his state is also the only community college in Alabama that has ever won a gold in welding at Skills USA. Welding instructor Jim Thompson credits the passion of his students for the school's success. If we didn't have students that were willing to work hard at it, we probably would not be sitting here at this point. Puts the program on, on a different level nationally because of that, because it, again, it's, it's a very tough competition. One of the ways Wall State teaches its welding students is with this virtual welding system. It allows students to make multiple reps with this virtual T joint, make sure they get the technique down just right until they have a score that they're happy with, and then they can start on the real deal. Thompson hopes kids will look at students like Humphrey and get inspired to join the skilled trades. These kids, when they come out, they are, they are craftsmen. They are a craftsman, so we have to think about it. We need craftsmen in our world to keep this world uh, turning. And now that Humphrey's competition days are behind him, he's looking forward to becoming a member of that world. I do some part-time work now, but I plan on either traveling or staying around close to the Huntsville area, welding in aerospace or something similar. Now to learn more about the welding program at Wallace State or the Skills USA competition, head over to waytv.com and click on this story under the Skills to Work tab.